So here's an example of two yellow rat snake eggs hatching. While I would usually have about 10 trays of eggs, maybe 30 in each tray, so 30 times, about 300 eggs going at any one time. So this is just an example of like maybe one tray is hatching. Uh, the two eggs here, plus what you'll see later as, as hatchlings. So these are baby yellow rat snakes. They will uh, develop the yellow color with the longitudinal tan lines down their back and down their sides. So I had to raise tons and tons of pinky mice to feed these guys. So I had mice everywhere. And, you know, people wanted young snakes, and you could keep them for like six months, feed them a few rats, and they double in size. So this example of one of uh, like eight to ten trays that I hatched in a um, short period of time. So we keep them, um, the eggs in sphagnum moss, keep them damp, and keep them relatively warm, and, and they would hatch. Yeah, it's just all by themselves. You didn't have to do anything. So it's just nature's way. And so here's an example of an adult yellow rat snake in the grass. And then after that, we'll see uh, me helping an adult yellow rat snake shed its skin. So that gives you an idea what they look like when they grow up.